everybody and welcome to another unboxing video. This is for a new brand, a new company that has reached out to me. It is called Your Creative Studio and I will link everything down below so you can find this. Um, but this is a monthly stationery um, kit in like a vintage style. So I'm really excited about this. When she would reached out to me, I hadn't heard of her before. And um, when I checked everything out, I was blown away with the selection of stuff that she had chosen. So let's just kind of jump in. The box is personalized, which I thought was really, really sweet. There's a little note right here, which I really love. And then this paper right here is just gonna be great to reuse. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start taking everything out and showing you all of the different items included. And I'm wondering if I should like slide everything out so it's not in the box. Oops, there we go. I feel like this, this will be just a little bit easier. <laughs> So I've got the website pulled up next to me so I make sure that I give you guys all the right information. This is April's box and April's box is now sold out. It is May's box that is going to be available now. The items are very similar and some of the items may even be the same, but the promo for April is different or for May is different. So in the month of April, if you signed up for a two or three month subscription, um, at one time, like at once, then you were gifted this really beautiful mini TN. This is homemade and it's just really, really lovely. The color is just to die for and it has two mini notebooks inside, which is just really, really great. The promotion for May, I believe, is that you get extra papers and an extra sticker sheet if you sign up for a two or three month subscription rather than just doing one month at a time. So that's really exciting. Let me just leave that open so you guys can see that. But let's just dig in. Now I do want to say again, this is April's box. These items are, uh, this particular box is not available anymore. It has sold out. But I wanted to show you the items just the same. So I'm going to pull this out and it looks like it is a stamp. How pretty is that? I love that. And I'm gonna stamp these images out, but I wanna open this one, if the box is gonna open for me. Look at these two together. Those are gonna just layer so beautifully together, I think. Love. Next we have a little daily plan notepad, which is super duper cute. When you open it up, it starts at 8 and it ends at 11 or 10. <laughs> I'm not good on uh, military time. Um, so that's really good. And it's craft paper and there are a lot of pages in here. How many pages? It doesn't say. <laughs> so that's really nice. Got something else here. Again, a little notepad. Oh, these are lovely. Look at the designs on this. Let's see if I should get a little closer so you guys can see the designs. So we have this one, this one, this one. There are a lot of designs in here and I love the theme of it. The male theme is just my thing. And then this one. Love, 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 love that. We've got some washi tape here with some alphabet font. So let's open and show that. I am never good at opening washi on film, I swear. <laughs> Every time I have to do it, it never goes well. I can never get the plastic to agree with me. So it's in this really vintage um, design right here. Love. So that's really pretty. We've got a, another little notepad. A 
looks like all the pages are the same and this is the design I really like this this is really cool and it's like an ivory color it's not like stark white so that's really really nice and we have a little package here and this has got some tabs in them with it's just a single-sided tab but these look like they were handmade which I can appreciate that takes time and effort to do and they're really pretty spring colors we've got a Another cute little envelope here. With some washi stickers. Look how pretty these are. I have always said that washi stickers are like my weakness. And look at look at these. Look how pretty. I am weak for washi stickers because they're thin, they don't bulk up the notebooks at all, and these designs are just lovely. Those are really, really pretty. Oh, there's one more in there. Pretty. Put this washi down. All right, next we have, it looks like a little paper pack here with some Alice in Wonderland themed stuff. This is really cool. This looks like a washi card. Or it could be used as a washi card. And then we've got these. These are really thick too. These would be great for tippins. So these two are postcards, which I can love and appreciate. And I love the style of those. Alright, next we have another little envelope here with three vintage floral postcards and I love these a lot. If I had a single flower for every time I think about you, I could walk forever in my garden. I love that. These are really gorgeous. I don't think they are exactly vintage, but they are meant to look like them because I have some vintage postcards that look just like this. And they are vintage, they're from the 20s. But these feel like they're gonna hold up well in the mail, so that's really cool. Next we have some sticky notes. Love the designs on these. Very vintage, they go with the theme very well. And we have some more stickers here. These also look like washi stickers. Pull those out so there's no glare. Look at the designs on these. These are really, really pretty. I'm probably going to use all of these <laughs> in the next month. These are really, really, really pretty. I love these a lot. And then here at the bottom, we have some origami paper, which you could... Oh, it's double-sided, too. You could just use this for layering, or you could use it for origami if you want, because it's a perfect square. These designs are really, really pretty. They're really simple and they go with the theme just beautifully. So all in all, my opinion is that this is a very heavy kit. There is a lot of, of stuff in here. So the kit is $27.98 um, and if you choose a two month subscription, it's $26.07. If you choose a three month prescription, it's $24.19. So you definitely get a discount if you choose to do um, two or three months at a time, which is really, really nice. And the, the vintage theme planner stationary box contains Pattern papers, a charm for the, I'm reading May's box. Um, two wooden stamps, two washies, a bag of junk journal papers, a sticker sheet, a notepad, transparent pattern papers, and little goodies. Please note from the May box, you will receive similar style items as in the April box in the image, but you will not be getting the mini notebook. That won't be an option for May's boxes. So, yeah, 
I'm really, really loving this. So I want to quickly stamp these images or these stamps here because I'm just gonna use black too. I always like to see how they turn out on paper versus the image on the stamp. And I want to make sure that I'm inking this really well. Sorry if there's a shadow there. Put that stamp there. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> that looks like it was meant to go on there. And then I will try the floral one. I am using my Memento black ink. It's my favorite black ink. And I will put this one right up here. Ooh, beautiful, clear, crisp images. Beautiful, I love them. They look like they were meant to be on this notepad. So freaking good. And the theme goes well with these stickers. There's florals here and florals on the stickers and it's just really, really good. I'm really loving everything in this kit. I think it's um, a great way, a great resource to use in your planner. You've got washi, you've got a way to keep track of your daily plan every single day. You've got decorative pieces, stickers, layering papers, tip-ins, washi stickers, tabs if you want to use tabs. I mean, there's just everything you could possibly need in here. And there's postcards to send to your friends. So I'm digging this a lot. <laughs> um, oh, and I forgot about the post-it notes too. So there's just everything you need. And it, the style is just really, really good. I'm really, really impressed with the price versus how much you get. Um, I am super weird about that. Like if I feel like I'm spending 30 or $50 on a stationary box and I'm only getting a few things, like I would rather have spent my 30 or $50 buying something that I know I would like and I would get a lot of versus, you know, only getting a few items that I may not necessarily use. And I feel like everything in this kit I would use and I feel like I really, the price is worth what you get in my opinion. So yeah, I'm not really concerned about brands. I've never heard of any of this stuff before. I don't know where it came from, but that doesn't concern me because I love the look of it all. So if brands are your thing, then I don't know if this is going to be your jam because I have never heard of any of this stuff before. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you will consider checking out your creative studio. I really am impressed. I really, really am. And I am going to encourage everybody to check them out. Um, Amanda's been really, really sweet to me over on Instagram. We've been talking about it for a couple weeks now and I just think she's great. So check them out on Instagram, check her website out and subscribe if you've liked what you've seen because I think it's a really great kit. All right, guys, that's all I've got for you. Thanks so much for hanging out. Bye.